Okay, we're gonna do the arena with its own thing just for like a cooldown video. We've had all these hard missions, but we're gonna instead do this arena thing. Just to chill out, you know, keep it cool. We're gonna try out the mini, 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 mini gun. And hopefully this will be a lot more relaxed than the nonsense we had previously. Because I'm not gonna lie. That mission made me angry, like, legit. Like, it legit made me angry. Evaluation program number 26, entering rank E. Subject AC, bitter promise. Call sign, no Zark. Commencing evaluation. Main system, activating combat mode. Easy money, like, this is what I mean, the arena's just for a chill out, you know, after that nonsense. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Well done. Well, I need to grind up some points anyway to check out the new stuff. Under a minute. Get some chips. I probably need to improve how much gets healed as well. I'm not sure. I wonder if we unlock parts for beating these guys or not. Because I know, like, I'm pretty sure in the older games you could unlock, I'm pretty sure you could unlock parts for, like, beating them. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 25, rank E. Subject AC, infection. Call sign, V6, Mater Link. Looks like a Decepticon, like, Commencing sound wave from the movies. Main system, activating combat mode. I'm not gonna joke, Michael Bay's sound wave, I actually sort of like this look. I, I, I didn't dislike it too much. I would say so this is gonna be an obnoxious enemy. Yeah, I get destroyed because he just spams this like is that sonic cannon that good? Because it feels like that sonic cannon just vaporizes you for no reason and I just say like Yeah. But do I have it? No, I don't. I have the you know, let's try a grenade launcher against it. It could work. Who knows? Maybe the grenade launcher will work. I doubt it, but it might. Grenade launcher small seems like good for like swarm missions or like stuff where you know you're fighting big things that are like are easy to dodge. What? Huh? 
did he even do to get my health down like that? Like, that cannon is ridiculous. Like, like it, what? Like, four or five strikes and my health just goes zoop. What is that guy's moveset? Like, that's obnoxious. Okay, what what do I invest in? Minigun was okay. Uh, um, does more damage than maybe single slash. Maybe do it like that. Maybe get a shield on. Put you on. Like, this, this is an interesting enemy, I'm gonna admit. Like, I, I love how I don't get annoyed by this enemy, because it's like, I'm just like, ah, oh, interesting attack. Like, it's very dodgy. So, minigun's probably the best choice, like, just with how dodgy it is. Lower its damage down a bit, hide behind the shield, and just fire this at it. I still wanna... Oh, apparently my shield's just been... Oh, there we go. Working again. Never mind, apparently... Apparently the shield's completely useless. Might as well just completely get rid of it then. Because most of my damage is in my melee. That is the truth. Most of my damage is in my melee. If I can't get the melee in, I'm sort of screwed. Oh, that's the irritation here, so I'm thinking maybe switch this back. Possibly get rid of you and replace you with you. Return you to how you originally looked. System activating combat mode. Well, that's the annoying issue. It's hard to hit. It. hard to get a single attack in because he just runs away 90% of the time so fast that you well, that's that's the issue you can't you can't get near him he just spans that attack and runs away it's so boring like that the enemy can just run away the entire game and you can't do anything especially when their attacks pretty much have pinpoint at like, literally, you could see the way it attacks curve. It's like, it's not like the attack has a straight line. No, it's like, it will literally just arc fully, like, 
Uh, well, I guess at least this enemy proved my theory with that one boss, like, where I was like, here, yeah, those attacks don't look right. At least it proved my theory on that. Yeah, I'm gonna need to use that because I need an attack that's quick. This video is going long. I thought it was just going to be a quick rush through, but instead I'm having to remodel my entire kit every time because this enemy's just spamming with that little. Like, I'm going to have to try out that Sonic gun because clearly it's better than I thought it would be. Okay, yeah, so just use this to avoid damage. So we just stay on the ground, we avoid damage, and we just spam range. And we just make it a war of attrition. Because the minigun's very good at keeping up with it. Bam. See what I mean? Clearly here in the space through the damage. Like that's been happening too much. No, I'm actually getting sick of that. AP at 30%. There we go, I figured it out. So yeah, keep out range, keep out range, get near stagger, watch for it to start triggering its shield and then slash it. That seems to be what works. So yeah, it does have an open strategy, but it's just very irritating to get it. Don't try and melee that enemy unless you feel like there's a giant open, like you see it start to stagger or slow or it's about to get stunned. Only then should you try and melee it. Otherwise, the, otherwise you're just going to get steamrolled. But I do want to try out that Sonic gun. There's also this. So it's this. You probably could make an Ava out of it. Yeah, you could probably make like an Ava. I'm going to try out this, because while I like my melee, I want to try this out. Purely just because I'm getting a little tired of this shenanigans. So I just want to see how this feels. Just, at least in the arena. Because that knows if I get stuck on a boss, then I can just switch out to this and just blast it to death. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 24, rank E. 
Subject AC, UAU. Call sign, Little Ziggy. Main system, activating combat mode. Could you imagine like if you had a super heavy armored but somewhat mobile character with all these rockets? Now that would be a nightmare to deal with. But yeah, oh okay, I can see why this is a good good mix. Target destroyed. So this thing runs out of a lot. I'm a lot quicker than the other guys did. But yeah, future tech Black Knight definitely working. I could probably use some chips, couldn't I? Like, do I put them into my defense since that seems to be kind of pointless at this point? I'm not gonna lie, it feels kind of pointless to put it into defense. A little improvement to repair kits would also be nice. Also, there's no sorting by new. Guess we're here in the final enemy. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 23, rank E, final evaluation. Subject AC, guidance, call sign V7 Swinburne. Hmm. Main system, activating combat mode. Yeah, how do, how do I activate my special, like, shield again? Well, can you not activate it here, I'm guessing? That makes sense. I guess you just can't activate it here. If you knew how much mashing I'm doing right now, except from like my um, side part. Come on. 
Which will last a little longer. Yeah, boy! Ooh. I mean, this is the kind of bullet hell I don't mind. Like, I'm not sure. If I was facing the other guy with this build, maybe I wouldn't have been so mad. Like, it, it feels like you definitely have to build a certain way for it not to be annoying. Like, it definitely feels like you have to build a certain way for it to not be annoying for you. You know? Unfortunate. I, I don't like being forced to build certain ways, but some bosses does seem to force your hand. Like, you could technically be it with anything, but it's very difficult. Congratulations. You have surpassed rank E. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All Mind exists for all mercenaries. It'd be great if I knew what I got given. Oh. Oh, I have to add it like this. Okay. That makes sense. No wonder I couldn't use it. Ugh. 